I'm starting a new LP. And of course, as you can see, it is Mountain Blade. So I'm going to start off, I'm going to have a male. Uh, improvised novel, I guess. A shop assistant. And um, investor student, I guess. And then we'll have the loss of a loved one. They're coming to venture and ride to cold area. So as you can see, we have loads of um, banners to pick from. Quite a lot. I think we'll go over this one. I'm going to cut without saving because I don't want to have to redo this. So. Let's confirm. So I tend to focus on intelligence, but I. Look me. And then we want the prison management right off the bat. Let's look, get a bit of trade. Uh, you, you'll see what, why I'm doing all this later on. I suggest um, getting some of the party skills started on now. Uh, for, I'll just get another prison management for that. And of course, well, I always use one handed weapons, it's all I use. So, don't want to waste too much time. We'll just get started. You arrive in Caldera, a land home between rival kingdoms, battling jumping supremacy, a haven for knights and mercenaries, cutthroats and adventurers, all willing to risk their lives in pursuit of fortune, power and glory. In this land which holds great dangers and even greater opportunities, you will leave your past behind and start a new life. Now on the rise above the distant training field, you now hold the key to your destiny in your hands. Free to choose as you will, but whatever course you take, great adventures await you. So you can see it's a training field and we're in the kingdom of Vigirs. Vigirs. And then, um, if I remember the Vigirs tech tree, the Vigirs generally have more units, but they tend to be weaker. No one wanted to join the party. Anyone who's ever played this game before will know that one of the main things you should do whenever you start any Mountain Blade game is to get some troops. Because you will not last 10 seconds on your own. So, I'm just going to head to the surrounding villages and just grab some recruits. Because that's really what you need to do on the first day. Just give it a shot. Generally, I am able to beat enemies with or that are a bit tougher than me in terms of numbers. But going again, it just shows you how skilled I am. So we've got so like 15 guys now. What have we got? 13 now. Oh, we've got 13 now. Let's travel. This is a town slash city. It's basically, um, can't hire guys from it, but it's mainly, it's mainly, it's mainly just a place to mess about. What the hell? Oh, else is just like on the screen here and it's causing me problems. So, tell me if you some matter for track, would you? Well, so it's a long story. I had been listening stand by the horse of my title, and I don't care. <laughs> I'm offended. Yes, I will be useful. I can't afford that amount. That's one of the main things during the early game. You will say, I can't afford that, I can't afford that. Seriously, sir? You mean you're gonna pay that much? Yep. And uh, it's not. It's kind of random. One of the things you want to do when you start off is probably start traveling around areas. Try and find something you can do. <coughs> Sorry if I sound a bit weird. I've got a bit of a cold at the moment. <coughs> Just post my um, 
Spore Creature Stage Part 3 episode, so. Oh, that's what's happened. Yeah. Baleni Wood Nuts. Move here. I don't even know. Is it a French accent? Anyways, I'm, this is really. I'm not sure what this is. So we got one swording recruit. We should do this the easy way. Or the hard way. Alright then. I think I'll choose the hard way. That's because you all die. So this basically what you do mantively. You basically run around killing people. Oh, no, not horse units. I don't like horse units. This is going to be so hard to do. You know what? That's what I'm going to... I was actually thinking about Colin Series. It's hard to be a hero. You know what? That further supports my claim of what I'm going to do. To find a way to get it fixed. No! See, I certainly need to get it fixed. This is so hard. Your companions are you away. Pull back, isn't it? Yeah. That's what you gotta do. Sometimes. Seriously. It's hard to be a hero, folks. It is hard to be a hero. So anyways, after that very big fail of the first battle, could we now view this place? Flooding militia, and they deserted their army. How smart. So they're gonna go to this castle. What are you punching for? Back home! Punch! So this is basically a guy saying he's been cheated out of his throne. So he's like, yay, someone to fight, and then of course, like, I do believe I've heard of you before. Why is it just don't end up? Right, um, what else can do? You can also just have a little walk around the streets, just see us busy life. That's the weapon smith. Militia, the town defenders, townswoman, that guy over there, who's a prison guard. One of the things that sort of weirds me out the most is the fact that, um, you ever notice during the, um, when you're looking at town, I always say they have this, this and that. And they'll say they have this, this and that it, as prisoners, yet, um, they only tend to prison like in prison like lords and stuff which is rather weird in my opinion oh god i don't know if you can see what's annoying me right here and seriously i do not i'm not gonna play with that horse merchant no just visiting around the areas so anyways that's um the town of the <laughs> i guess it was called Anyways, we're coming up on the minute ma on the um, no, ten minute mark, so I guess that's it for me. On the next episode, we shall be finally taking on a bandit and winning. But until then, see you guys next time.